you also mentioned building relationships. Um, besides collaborating with artists, what's a way? Uh, because as an artist myself, you know, you may not always connect with somebody's art in the beginning. Right. Right. But uh, the the game is a it's a friendship or a popularity contest a lot of the times, right? And and it's about how you can connect with a person. And so if that person connects with you, you know, as a as your personality uh, attracts to theirs, music can come from that connection. Right. Um, do you find that to be true? And I think I think number one yeah. is the relationship and how you buy yeah. the one another because all collaborations are good. I mean, it's just like a marriage. Mm -hmm. You can't hook up with somebody just because of whatever, finances or whatever. You have to be able to actually live with that person. One of my favorite collaborators is somebody I met like 30 years ago. This guy is most, the most unlikely parent. He's like about two years older than me, white guy, a uh, Jewish guy, and we met at a conference and we just happened to sit next to each other at lunchtime. And we didn't talk about music. You know, we talked about our old ladies and you know, all of the kind of stuff. You know, we realized that, God, we really liked each other. We had the same interests. We had the same um, taste in music, you know. And so, you know, at the very end of the whole lunch thing, we said, hey, let's get together and write something. Well, Andre is a hit songwriter. Andre used to, um, he, well, he's got songs with Bonnie Ray. He writes rock stuff. So, you know, Bonnie Ray, country stuff, Tim McGraw, Waylon Jennings, you know, people like that. And um, so, um, so the relationship thing and the vibe is is really important because you can be a brilliant cat who does jazz and it can be a brilliant cat who does um, heavy metal, but it might just not work together, you know. And so, like, you know, being with somebody that you can really have fun with and create with is is really key. So, in you going out in the world and then networking and stuff. Um, it's important to do that, to really just buy with people, not just hook up with people because, you know, of who they are and what they can do. And so, like, you know, you might, you know, hook up with ten people before you find one or two that you really buy with, and those are people that you connect with. Peace challenge.